The core curriculum standards that we use ask that the children have memorized addition and subtraction facts up to 20. So today was a way for me to check in and see what they're doing and then I was able to use the Google Forms app and from that I used Fluberu extension to quickly find out where the students are performing with their addition and subtraction facts how many they've had memorized and also how quickly they're able to complete them. And then based on that information, I was able to see who has met the goal and who still needed additional support and practice in meeting the goal. Today I'm going to ask team captains to come up and I'm going to ask them to scan our code. The code is going to take us to a math checkup. It's like a little mini math quiz. There are 10 addition problems and 10 subtraction problems. Just like when we do this, my team captains are gonna scan and then they're gonna bump to the people at their table group. Once you have the app open in front of you and you have the checkup open, to start, tablets are face down. Read it with me, start. Tablets face down. That shows me I have it, I'm ready to go, Mrs. Mealy, my tablet is face down. I took out three different colors of index cards and laid them on the children's desk based on what their level was. All I did was pick up the yellow index cards in my hand, I looked at the top five kids on my list, and then I quickly went to their desks and put them out. Then I picked up the next color, put them out quickly, and then the last group. Getting everything set up took less than a minute, and in three minutes I was able to find out where they're performing and what they need to do next. Once they had their color index card on their desk, they were able to check the board and see what level they were practicing on Math Bingo and get started right away. The whole process of assessing and then doing extra practice took less than five minutes to get started.